Wonder Woman have always wanted to go on the London Eye, see Big Ben, and watch the Bobby's Garden of Queen. Oh, and not to forget, eat strawberries and ice cream. So when my mom told me we were expecting visitors from England, I couldn't wait to meet them. Our introductions were interesting, to say the least. I hardly understood a word they said, and I thought we spoke the same language, English. Things got more interesting when the children asked for directions to the shop. We said, walk along the pavement, turn left at the robots, and right at the traffic circle. They looked at us as if we were aliens, speaking another language. Their father had to interpret. Walk along the sidewalk, turn left at the traffic lights, and right at the roundabout. <laughs> when we said we were going to have a bride with burro bushels, we may as well say they were going to look on the moon. Barbecuing with sausages would have made more sense to them. It looked like when it came to English, we learned from different dictionaries. It's not men from Mars and women from Venus, but it's Pongs from Mars and South Africans from Venus. <laughs> South Africans may be English, but we are undeniably South African. Here are some of my thoughts on what makes us undeniably South African. South African men don't do much. I was shocked to see our visitor's dad packing the lunches for the day's outing and doing the ironing. That would never ever happen in our house. <laughs> not necessarily the same English, and in my heart, I'm undeniably South African. 